This is the ventricular system. It's a set of communicating cavities within the brain filled with cerebrospinal fluid. And the fluid flows from the lateral ventricles down into the third one and so on. But the interesting part is this hole right here. So let me bring in the thalamus. As you can see, the thalamus is closely related to the ventricular system. More precisely, the third ventricle here divides the thalamus into two parts, the left and the right lobe. So, if I hide this lobe, here we can see the interthalamic adhesion. It connects the left and the right lobes of the thalamus. But the interesting part, as I said, is that the third ventricle has a specific hole for the interthalamic adhesion to pass through. The question is, is there any special function that is yet to be discovered that is the result of the close topographical anatomical relationship between the thalamus and the ventricular system? As you can see, it is very closely related.